CM365 all about Carnatic music. It is interesting to see how some time measures which are actually not found in the basic uh, Sapta Talas, the seven Talas, yet they occupy a very prime position in the Carnatic music itself. Yes, I'm talking about the Champu Talas which have been existent from the very early times. In these Talams we see that uh, they actually have their origin in folk music and there are many such uh, folk melodies based on these Champu Talas. And uh, they are a class apart in the sense that while the Sapta Talas necessarily have the Angas, they may have a Lagu, the Drutam or Anudrutam or a combination of all of them. These Chapu Talas actually do not have any kind of Angas and uh, they are reckoned by beats. In this uh, again we can have the varieties like Tisra Chapu, Chatusra Chapu, Khanda Chapu, Mishra Chapu and Sankirna Chapu. But Popularly, compositions have been composed only in the Khanda Chapu and the Mishra Chapu. So, we look into these two Thalas now. Now, what is Khanda Chapu? It is a Thalam which has got five units of time and is reckoned like 1, 2, 1, 2, 3, 1, 2, 1, 2, 3. That is, in the 1, 2, the 1 is reckoned with a beat, then 1, 2, 3. In the 3, we have two beats and the third uh, is silent. So, 1, 2, 1, 2, 3, 1, 2, 1, 2, 3. The Mishra Chapu Thalam actually has got uh, five units and rendered as 1, 2, 3, 1, 2, 1, 2, 1, 2, 3, 1, 2, 1, 2. Now, these two Thalas have been very effectively used by our composers so, uh, in terms of Composition starting on the beat and also taking up other Oedipus as well. We look into a few compositions in uh, Khanda Chapu. Uh, the most popular one is uh, Guru Leka Yetuminti composed by Shri Tyagarajar in Gauri Manohari which goes like Guru Leka Yetuminti Guni Ke Teliya Kapodu Guru Leka Yetuminti Guni Ke or a composition of Sri Koti Shura Ayer. Kai Kuda Venu Me Kanda Nina Rulgene Kum Kai Kuda Venu Me Kanda Nina Rulgene Kum Kai Kuda Venu Me or a composition of Patnam Subramani Ayer. Mari vere di kyo varu ramaya. Now, Tyagaraja has also explored another possibility of Oedipa here through the composition. Nivada ne gaana, nivada ne gaana. Starting after one unit. So, Tyagaraja of course is a master where every talam, every ragam you see that he explores it to the maximum possible and here also the same thing applies. Coming to the Mishra Chapu talam, it is a more natural kind of a flow it has got like 1, 2, 3, 1, 2, 1, 2, 1, 2, 3, 1, 2, 1, 2, 1, 2, 3, 1, 2, 1, 2, where you see that there are empty number of compositions here like that of Papanasam Sivan. Mahalakshmi Jagarmata Manami Rangi Varamarul or a composition of uh, our uh, own Tyagaraja. Nidhi Jagale Sukama or Pankaj Lochana Pahibu Rantake Pankaj or a composition of Tyagaraja. Nike Daya Raka Neje Upanu Lilla or a 
composition of Swati Tirnal. Bhakta Pahra Yerna Mama So here again we see that in Mishra Chaku, there are three possibilities in terms of the Edipi. One is on the beat itself like I showed now. Mahadehshmi. Another possibility that Tyagaraja explored is after three units like Taketa Nidhicha Alasukama. That is a slightly rare one. Then the other possibility is after taking Takademi. That after that is uh, one, two. After two in the if you were going to reckon it as one, two, three, one, two, one, two, one, two. Nike So thus we see that uh, this Mishra Chapu and Khanda Chapu, though they basically have got their origin in the folk music. They have come to be used very effectively as part of the compositions in Carnatic music. And of course, when we uh, just mention Chapu Tala, it generally refers to the Mishra Chapu. And the others, though they are there, we see that it is only the Khanda Chapu and Mishra Chapu which have come to uh, occupy an important place in terms of compositions being composed in them. CM 365, all about Carnatic music.